take, or, or Wade Baldwin rather, comes out to take on Steven Aarons. Aarons in the black and red trunks, white trunks for Baldwin. Both fighters getting up in that D-line experience coming into early play here for Aarons. Uh, uh, not often you can throw a knee in that kind of scenario and not walk away with a penalty. And a big shot there by Wade Baldwin, but Aarons getting right back up. A multiple big shots here landing, and uh, I say big shots because they're heavyweights. Every single one of their shots is big. Well, either one of these fighters weighs more than some of our combined fighters in earlier fights tonight, and uh, and both of these guys looking to uh, finish this one out. Uh, taking him down with the uh, guillotine choke attempt. Here's Wade Baldwin trying to finish this one early like he got finished a couple months ago. Well, what he needs to do here is he's just trying to use his arms. He's got to hip in, so he's got to step in in that situation. I don't, again, you've heard me say it multiple times, I don't like going down, but you can step in and hip in to be able to put the, uh, the, the damage down there. Aaron's now with Baldwin up against the cage. Aaron's looking to pop out. And he does now. Pushing him up against him. At the heavyweight division, this does wear people out. Just leaning on them, having all your body weight on somebody. It's here, you carry me for a while. I don't want to do it anymore. Well, and Aaron's came in at 255 pounds. So you can imagine the, uh, like you said, the weight that that puts on Baldwin. But Baldwin comes out swinging. Both fighters uh, really trying to to throw and Baldwin trying to throw everything he has at Aaron's. Aaron's just turning around, stumbling, but manages to land a couple punches of his own. No questioning the chin of Steven Aaron's here in round number one. Yeah, big shots again landed, and uh, Baldwin's really not turning his hips. These are just arm shots. As he, if he were able to turn his hips and uh, be able to uh, really get into each one of these punches, use his legs as uh, extra power. But again, great chin from Steven Aarons. And a big uppercut from Aarons there up against the fence. Again, uh, must bring back memories for Aarons as two big guys just going at it. And uh, this time now up against the cage, Baldwin grabs out one of Aarons' legs and now lays a knee into the chest and has him down. Baldwin now, or Aarons looked like he was trying maybe for the double leg. But Baldwin able to push him back up against the cage. And again, his landing strikes to the side of the head, which can't do anything but look good in the eyes of the judges. Yeah, any one of these strikes is going to look good for the judges. And uh, this uh, round decidedly to Wade Baldwin, uh, I think that, uh, and some foot stomp action going on there, and those always hurt. As we get set for round number two, starts much the same as round number one. As Baldwin charges forward, they get up against the fence and they both start throwing bombs. Aarons has Baldwin in a little bit of trouble here in the early going up against the fence, but now Baldwin manages to bull rush his way back out into the center of the cage and push Aarons up against the fence and a big uppercut there as Aarons ate the fist of Baldwin on that one, you could see his head snap back. This is almost looking like a Rocky fight as they continue to come forward. No real covering up, just off the chin, off the chin, off the chin. And there's some huge shots and just some pawing at one another, but each time one of those paws lands on the face, you can tell it hurts. Well, again, you can watch their heads reel with the impact of these punches as both fighters giving it their all here. And now it's those meat hooks just digging into the side of the body of, of Wade Baldwin as he keeps going forward. And, and Steven Aaron's just, I mean, it doesn't look like he should be on his feet. He keeps staggering step after step after step, but he is still going. Elvis Lyons right on top of the action. We have seen some very impressive knockouts tonight, and Elvis Lyons been right on top of them, and he's right on top of them here, but Steven Aaron taking everything Baldwin has to give and just continuing to move forward. Yeah, these are some big shots here, and Elvis right in there, but uh, still nothing. And all these guys, a huge right hand. Both these guys are just throwing. This is, uh, this is, yes, it's a mixed martial arts fight. I will like to classify this as a bar room brawl where everybody, the two guys have had too many to drink and this is what they're doing now. Well, you can see both of them now 
collapsing to the floor. Baldwin staggering away from that last exchange. Aaron's now trying to get something done, but just laying on Baldwin to catch his breath, driving a knee into Baldwin's ribs for good measure, which can't be helping Baldwin, who's also trying to catch his breath at this point, as those knees will start to take a toll. We have seen MMA fighters uh, uh, just uh, effectively submitted from knees to the side. Uh, uh, George St. Pierre winning his fight against Matt Serra in that fashion, but uh, at this point, Aaron and Baldwin now just exhausted as we reach the end of round number two. It looks like they're gonna get stood up. If they can stand up, both of these fighters have given it their everything in the first couple minutes. And I think Aaron thinks the round is over. Elvis Lyon directing him to the corner. Ball just resting against the fence. <laughs> I think Aaron both of them think the round is forward. over. Aaron now starting to move forward. Baldwin still up against the fence. Now he comes off and he eats a right hand as a result. And I think that is now the end of round number two. And they touch gloves with a smile at center. And they go back to throwing wildly. Another big right hand from Aaron. He's starting to land the better of the strikes here in the late going of this fight. Well, and nobody can question Baldwin's chin now. as these two fighters now go to the ground and are looking to continue uh, to fight here in round number three. Again, Elvis Lyon right on top of the action here as both fighters looking to finish. Aaron now climbing on top and we'll see if he can make work of Wade Baldwin here now that he's got a mount. I don't know what, how much power he's gonna have behind his punches though, Jeremy. Gravity. Gravity and 250 pounds is, is what amount of power. And each one of these punches has the ability to be able to land significant damage. And uh, not really posturing up is Steven Ahrens. And uh, this is something that if, uh, if he comes out on the wrong end of this decision, he wants to look back. And just even posturing up and coming down with gravity would be enough to do a lot extra damage. Aaron's now on top of Baldwin, holding him down with the elbow, trying to get a punch through, and that one seemed to land. A couple now landing to the body, maybe trying to go body, body, head, but a lot of time in between those punches as, uh, again, uh, Elvis Lyon checking on uh, Wade Baldwin to see if he's all right, to see if he can continue, and that is it. The fight is over.